Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. So I've been online shopping a lot lately. Well, I'd say online browsing. I haven't really bought anything recently, but I've been browsing a lot on websites, um, looking for staple pieces I want this summer. And because the Ritzia June clientele sale is coming up, I thought I'd share my process of shopping and basically some really good items that I'll keep my eyes out for. So I'm going to go to what I have saved on my list on their Ritzia website. And I think the first one I'm going to talk about is these shorts. These are the Labyrinth Shorts by Wilfred. Original price is 98 bucks, and I definitely would not pay $98 for a pair of shorts like these. Like, at most, I think I'd pay $98 for a pair of, like, jean shorts. But I do have a pair of Aritzia shorts that are, um, I love them. I bought them on sale. I think they were only, like, 40 bucks, which I think is, like, a reasonable, pri reasonable price. $100 is getting close to what I pay for pants and jeans and for like less than half the material it doesn't make sense but um these shorts look so comfy and they look like something you can dress up and dress down and i really like them in this light birch color um let's see what else it looks like so i like the cuff at the front i'm not sure how i feel about it at the back just because i don't i don't know they just look really thick from the back and they're more, more noticeable than the front. I'm afraid they're gonna be a bit see-through. Um, I don't know if there's a problem there. Like even when I zoom in on like where the shorts, or not the shorts, where the pockets are, I feel like I can kind of see them. So it kind of gives me a hint that I think they're a bit see-through, but we'll see. Anyways, I really like this color. Um, I'm kind of scared that they'd get stained if I sat on grass or anything, so I'd have to be like really careful with them. But I think a light like white or like cream is such a cute color for summer, especially if you want to look more tan. And if you only tan a little bit, like white just helps it out a lot. Um, it like emphasizes your tan. That's the word I'm going for. Um, yeah, and I think if you wore this with like. A jean jacket or a blazer on the weekends would be so cute. It would dress it up so well. So yeah, I would hope they'd go down. Like I'd buy them if they went down to 60, but I don't think they will because they're $100 originally. So we will see if I actually end up buying them. Hopefully they'll go on clearance maybe at the end of the summer. Um, the second one I want to show or talk about today are the Jimmy pants. So the Jimmy pants have been in my my list for literally forever they look so comfy i have this thing for plaid pants and i like really want to buy a pair of plaid pants but i'm not sure if they're just like an insta like a temporary style thing like they're just gonna shift down and i don't want to i feel like it's i'm so late in the trend that i don't really want to buy them now but they do look comfy they remind me of the on the fly plant pants from lululemon which i absolutely love they're like slightly cropped they go to like right above my ankle um they're like a straight fit and they're so comfy and i feel like these would be the exact same thing but these ones can be dressed up more i also feel like you could wear this with just like a t-shirt with like doesn't even have to be a plain t-shirt like the t-shirt can have like a little embroidery sign on here or like words on the front and i feel like that'd be really cute even if i wore it with like an oversized black t-shirt and like tucked in um, the shirt on the pants so it's like slightly baggy but yeah I think it'd be so cute you could wear it with a jean jacket you could wear it with a blazer you could wear it to work I don't love the price I mean it's $130 I would buy them at original price but I really love them I have not tried them on which is the only thing I'm scared of but it would be nice if they went down to 100 that'd be my ideal price I'd say okay so the next one I want to talk about is the Effie cardigan so I've been really into these, this um, cardigan look. I've been scrolling on Pinterest so much and I think it's like when you wear a bra top underneath and you button up like the first button so it kind of like goes out like this. I think that's so cute if you wear with high waisted jeans. Um, and even if the bra top is like colored underneath, this comes in a space and a, a sky blue. 
I definitely like these space better just because I think a cardigan is like a staple. Um, you can wear it two ways. You can wear it like button up. You can wear it with the one button. You can wear it open. And I think from there, like whatever you wear underneath can kind of be your experimental like color, your bright pop of color. But I think white is such a staple. I say staple a lot, but I think that's what it is. Like I don't experiment, like I don't experiment with colors a lot. And I think it's just because colors go in and out and I do love um, wearing colors sometimes. I'm obsessed with blue. I wear blue all the time. Um, I don't know, but I'm trying to get away from blue just because I have so many pieces in my closet that are blue. Okay, the next one I'm gonna talk about is actually this rib raw top. I actually really love this trend of the like sage green. I think this one is not sage green. It's a bit darker. It's called dry basil green, which I absolutely love too. I think it's so cute. So this top is really similar to this white one I have. This one's from Garage. Um, but I want something that can serve as a top and as a bra. I kind of want it to serve as a sports bra, but not look like a sports bra. There's a bit of a dilemma there, but... Um, yeah that's where i'm coming from as you can see this is why i struggle to buy things so the back is really cute it's a bit lower cut than the front i wonder if it's reversible if you can wear like the lower cut at the front because i'd really like that because i think it gives like um a total different look i'm really scared of the front and back looking like a sports bra because sports bras can be boxy especially if it's like too high cut at the front like I think it needs to be a little lower like this looks pretty high on her um I think if it came down a little bit that'd be really cute it'd look less um like a sports bra and I wish it was kind of cropped um just under the boobs a little bit but yeah I like this color and I think I like oh this one too the plain air which is another blue it's like a very very light blue i honestly sometimes can't tell the difference between the plain air and white but it's very cute i love it i think the white is really similar to this other top i have from maritzia i showed in my videos before it's like the one shoulder i forget what it's called oh the arginate top or that's what it used to be called but um yeah if you scroll back to a couple of, um of my old videos you'll see it but it's like ribbed and it's um one shoulder and it's like white i chose white because that's like a staple but i think the ribbed and white just like looks too similar so i'd probably go for like a color that i could wear all the time but also um something that's not as like basic i am really into nudes right now too i don't know what it is like nudes are really in right now and i think nudes never go out i like the dark brown look like i wish i could buy like a really dark like it's kind of like a chocolate brown like a chocolate brown bra top with chocolate brown um sweat shorts i think that look is really cute i'm not sure how this one would look on me i'm really bad with seeing how tans look on my skin i don't know what it is i want to buy them i want to buy nudes but i just can't see it on myself like it's so hard for me to buy okay so the next one I'm gonna do, let's see, is, oh, this one, the TNA Body Cane Top. So I saw this last night and I fell in love with it immediately. Like, it's so cute. I, I think it kind of reminds me of a swimsuit and that's why. And I wish it had a bit more material because I think it is very revealing, especially if I want to wear it just as like, a bra top and not as a bra I'm not yeah I think I'd have to try it on to figure it out if I actually would wear it as a bra top and not just a bra but I think $25 is really affordable like this one from um from garage is only 20 bucks and honestly I expected Aritzia bras to be closer to 30 35 and some of them are but I think $25 is such an affordable affordable price I'd probably buy it in black um just because I think the orange has this sporty look to it and I'm not going for a sporty look. I definitely would wear it with biker shorts or with like my leggings or high-waisted jeans and maybe like high-waisted black jeans with the black cane top 
and um, a denim jacket, that would be a very cute look. And yeah, so those are the, I don't know how many items I talked about today, but those are the items that I'll probably keep my eyes out for um, during the clientele sale. I know it's coming up. I'm not sure when mine will open because again, like I think Aritzia does like a rolling basis clientele sale based on how much you spend a year but we will see yeah let me know what you guys are gonna buy i'd be interested to see i always am adding things to my list as aritzia keeps on adding things to their website so i hope you guys have a nice day bye